Hello you guys, welcome to my channel. Um, I wanted to tell you today that we had gone to a store and I saw a black caterpillar walking or crawling across the parking lot. So I went over to it and I picked him up and I actually brought him home. Um, and he is a giant um, leopard caterpillar. He's all black and he does have some red lines across his back that you can see. Um, I'll get him out in a couple minutes so you guys can see him, but I'd never seen one of these caterpillars before either until today. Um, he is found in southern Canada to Florida to Texas. Um, he is a moth, so he's nocturnal. Um, he'll come out at night. They eat at night. They fly at night. Um, and they eat a lot of like cabbage and sunflower, um, oak and cherry, dandelion, um, let's see, avocado, and they are friendly. They don't sting. They don't bite. Um, and let's see, they are the largest eastern tiger moth. So he's going to get pretty big. Um, the ring, wingspan is about 5.7 to 9.1 centimeters, so he'll be pretty big. Um, and when they're smaller, they are black, and they do have brown stripes, similar to the woolly bear, but they do look a little different. As they do get bigger into the adult caterpillar, they're just the plain black with the red stripes on them. Um, and it does, I'll show you... Um, I have my, my book here, The Caterpillars of Eastern North America, um, and the top here on this side, there he is, the caterpillar, and then this is the moth he will become. He's real pretty. He's white with uh, some black spots and maybe some blue as well. Um, so I'm hoping to keep this guy over the winter as well. He will... Um, hibernate he might um decide to make a cocoon because he is an adult he's pretty big um but if not then he will make a cocoon in the springtime but like i said i'm going to try and keep him um hang on and let me get him out for you so you guys can see him here he is i put him down here on on our board here and he is kind of walking a little bit but you can see better how big he is. Let me see if you can. He, like I said, has red stripes on him. When he's really stretched out, you can see those. I don't know. He's moving around, but. There's a little bit as he's turning. Let's see, I'm going to turn this around here. But he won't hurt you. He does look like the woolly bear with all the spikes on him. But he's harmless. He doesn't sting. He doesn't bite. I picked him right up and it didn't even bother him when I, when I got him from the parking lot. But he is different from the woolly bear. Like I said, he's the giant leopard caterpillar. Here he is crawling up my hand. Doesn't seem to be bothered by me. All right, so I wanted you guys to see the size difference. Over here was the small, plain brown um, caterpillar that I had found. Um, and then in the middle here is the woolly bear. 
And then over here is the giant leopard caterpillar. I just wanted you guys to see the difference on how big they are. Oh, I guess he's checking the, the leopard out there. But they shouldn't hurt each other.